guys welcome back to another video if you're new here hi thank you for popping in and if you enjoy the video don't forget to like and subscribe and um, today I am going to bring you new Slim and Well goodies that I have found whilst out and about for some of you this might be old really old and you're thinking what you're on about Nicola I've had hold of these for ages but this is stuff that's been really really keeping me on track recently so the first thing that I've got to show you are these naked rice pots in katsu curry flavour these are two sins and are so, so worth it. Um, they're on deal at the moment in Asda for 75p and it says that they have a mild rating. They're just really handy for when you're on the go and need a really, really quick lunch or even just a snack. The next thing that I have got, I have been wanting to try something like this for ages but if I'm perfectly honest with you it just doesn't fit into my weekly budget. But I got given some money for my birthday so I treated myself. <laughs> <laughs> the lady in home sense for I was mad so I was so excited but I found some of the skinny syrup whipping foam whipped foam sorry um, and this is in the flavour maple bourbon I think I paid 4 99 for this it's quite big though as you can see and Ged doesn't like it so I'm the only one that uses it and I've been really really loving this and it saved me when I've needed a sweet fix and also I put this on top of coffee when I have it black because I sometimes want to use my A on cheese. This is brilliant. Next thing that I got is this true nut peanut butter. So it's powdered peanut butter and you mix it with cold water and then spread it on whatever you want to, use it with whatever you want to. I actually made some homemade cinnamon well granola the other day using my healthy extra beet oats and some of this and it was really, really good. This is chocolate flavour. This was £4 for the tub and it is a... 190 gram tub um, and for two tablespoons of this mixed with water for you Slim and Wilders it is free sins but I used a tablespoon of it the other day of my granola and it was absolutely fine. The next thing I've got to show you are these they are the Bon Maman Petite Tartlets they're chocolate caramel flavour these I have shown you before but I have just fallen back in love with them and they've really really helped me the last couple of weeks. TMI, Mother Nature visited and I am a sucker for sweet treats when that's going on and these have saved me. They're three and a half sins each, they're not very big um, but they do the job and they're £1.50 a box from Waitrose. The next thing I've got to show you um, are the skinny syrups. Now this one isn't necessarily my favourite flavour, it's the glazed donut one. It's just very very sweet, I wouldn't say it tasted like a donut. I had high expectations like I did for the Muller, the raspberry donut with the Muller, and I don't know how I'm expecting these things to actually taste like a donut, but nonetheless, skinny syrups are a lifesaver for adding sweetness to baked oats, coffees, all the bits like that. So, oh, and you can mix this with quark too, and that's really, really good. So, this is definitely a winner for me. I haven't actually tried them yet, but I love flumps. Are these mini flumps? They were 89p a bag in Home Bargains and they're half a sin each. I'll open them. Oh! So they're that big. I love flumps. I'm going to make a hot chocolate with them later. The next new find. Now, I was lucky enough to win a competition on Jane Brad Bradder's Instagram. She was giving away a fake away selection of JD seasonings, and I have to say, I absolutely love them. All of their pots, these spice pots, are sin free. Um, and the ones I've just grabbed off the shelf to show you are the salt and pepper chips and the Spanish chicken. We've used um, the chip seasoning, we've used the doner kebab seasoning and I think we've used the burger blend um, and Bombay potatoes and I am so so impressed with how much flavour they add to your meal and I don't think you can ask for anything else when they're sin free um, so really really recommend them and once I've used this up I'll definitely be repurchasing. The next thing that I've got to show you are these snow rolls. As you can see we have finished the box. They're basically long marshmallows covered in chocolate with a sprinkling of coconut. Now coconut is Isaac's favourite thing in the world so these were a winner. Um, and I found them in Poundland so obviously a pound. You get 16 in a box. So they're also gluten free and there's a lady in my Slim World group who was really pleased to hear these are gluten free and perfect with a coffee. To show you this is the second bag that we purchased are the Asda Whirly Treat Bars. I saw these over on Katie Jane SW's channel. And I have to say, they just really do the job. I'll show you how big one is. They're basically like mini um, Milky Ways. But again, just something that 
I've been glad to get my hands on when I needed that sweet treat, but you're not busting the old sim bank for them. So that's the packaging. And they were definitely a pound or under as well. So I hope some of that helped you guys. Like I said, this is just the things that's been getting me through the last few weeks. I do have a sweet tooth, you must already know that. Um, but definitely go and try the Naked Rice Pots. Really, really recommend them. They are so delicious. I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you all in my next one. Bye!